Welcome to This Week in Adventist History. On November 29, 1882, the New England Conference voted to form a permanent school in the U.S. state of Massachusetts. This was the outcome of a meeting nine months earlier, in February 1882, of the New England Tract and Missionary Society, at which its president, Stephen N. Haskell, who you see here, proposed that the society consider establishing a Seventh-day Adventist school in New England. There was strong support, and in April 1882, a school opened with 19 pupils. The teachers were mostly stalwarts of the local tract and missionary society, including Haskell, Maria Huntley, who you see in this photo, and Doris A. Robinson. The school was initially unnamed, being simply referred to by Seventh-day Adventists as the New England School. But by the autumn, with a new academic year underway, the decision was taken to establish a school according to Massachusetts state law, and the following year it was incorporated under Massachusetts law as South Lancaster Academy. Goodloe Harper Bell became the first official principal. The academy later developed into Atlantic Union College, but the academy operated separately and it survived the closure of the college in 2018. It is the oldest Adventist secondary school founded as a secondary school, second only to Battle Creek Academy, which split off from Battle Creek College. On November 30, 1973, the name of Port of Spain Community Hospital in Trinidad was changed to Port of Spain Adventist Hospital. It had been founded as Port of Spain Seventh-day Adventist Clinic in 1948. In 1994, the hospital's name was changed again to Community Hospital of Seventh-day Adventists. Today, it is an 80-bed hospital that treats around 35,000 patients every year. And on December 2, 1958, Queen Sirikit of Thailand opened a new building for the Bangkok Adventist Hospital School of Nursing. Adventist medical work in Thailand dates back to the founding of Bangkok Mission Clinic in May 1937 by two American medical missionaries, Dr. Ralph F. Waddell and his wife Ellen. In 1946, the clinic became Bangkok Mission Sanitarium and in 1947 its School of Nursing was opened. Today the hospital still operates under the title Mission Hospital Bangkok. It is a 120-bed hospital that treats some 137,000 patients annually. And that was this week in Adventist History.